Hey everyone, so today's video is going to be a nail tutorial video which is inspired by acid wash denim which is really in right now. It's definitely, you know, any kind of printed jeans are just super popular right now. So I'm going to insert a photo really quickly of the acid wash denim that I, I was inspired by for this tutorial. And here is the final result that I achieved and it's so easy to do and if you don't want to go for like a classic acid wash denim look with like the blue and the white you could totally do any colors neon colors a different color on every nail and you do need two different colors per nail so you could do like different colors on every single nail if you wanted to you could really be creative with this manicure all you're going to need is some nail polish remover I recommend nail polish remover with acetone in it I didn't try this with non acetone nail polish remover so I'm not sure how that would work um, but I'm gonna get into the tutorial and then stay tuned after the tutorial for like my tips and tricks because there are a couple ways you can actually mess it up believe it or not because it's so easy um, but definitely stay tuned towards the end if you are really wanting to actually try this manicure out so I hope you guys like it I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and I will see you afterwards we're gonna start with a blue base and I used Sally Hansen's Pacific blue and you're just going to put it directly over and I did two coats of the blue because when you use your nail polish remover, you want to make sure that none of the blue actually gets picked up. Um, only the white does. And after I'm done applying the white, I'm going to let it dry completely. You want to make sure that it's completely 100% dry. There's no stickiness to it or your Q-tip with the nail polish remover on it is going to just kind of smudge around and pick up not only the white but the blue as well because um, putting the white on kind of re remakes the blue wet, if that makes sense. this completely dry probably for 10 minutes or so until it, there's no stickiness and then I'm going to come back with my nail polish remover and show you how to do it. Now the white has dried I'm just going to dip my q-tip into my acetone nail polish remover and just rub it over the nail and kind of twist the q-tip as you go because you are picking up the white nail polish on the q-tip and you want to make sure it's always fresh. Sometimes you have to use two Q-tips per nail because um, you pick up quite a bit of the white polish. So kind of just like that, just rub off the white. Try not to pick up any of the blue, that's why we did two coats of blue. Um, and it'll just give you a really cool acid wash denim kind of look. And also one other tip is to make sure your um, Q-tip is super saturated in the um, nail polish remover. Don't like dab it off or um, remove any of the polish. Dip it right into the nail polish remover and make sure there's a lot on there. It'll go a lot faster that way. And try not to rub too long in one spot because you don't want to pick up the blue. I just finished applying my top coat so they're nice and shiny now so I have these awesome acid wash kind of denim looking nails and I think they're really cool and pretty and continue watching if you want to hear some of my like tips and tricks regarding this manicure. So my tips regarding this manicure because there are ways to mess it up, make sure whatever base color you're doing you do two coats, make sure those two coats are completely dry before you do um, the top color that you're, that you're going to choose. And also make sure that top color is totally dry before you um, start smudging it off with acetone. If not, your Q-tips are going to get stuck to it. It's actually going to get remove the underneath color as well. It's like a huge mess. I learned the hard way. You want to make sure it's totally dry. So don't be impatient with this manicure. But a good tip is if it's still a little bit sticky because you are using three coats of polish, dip your nails in some really, really cold ice water. That'll take away the stickiness right away. And then you can go in with your nail polish remover. I'd love to see the color combinations that you guys come up with because you can just do, you know, acid wash nails it doesn't have to, it doesn't have to be acid wash denim nails you can just do an acid wash manicure which you know use any colors that you want and if you do try this out it's so easy I hope that you do um, send me a photo on Twitter or my Facebook page at Miss Jen Fabulous and I would love to see your photos so I hope you enjoy the video I hope you like the tutorial and I'll have photos I forgot to mention on my beauty blog polish and pearls.com of my nails so if you want to see like up close photos and stuff I will have that blog post down below for you guys. So thank you for watching and subscribing, and I will talk to you guys very soon. Bye.